On behalf of the students, faculty, and staff of East Georgia State College, welcome to our spring 2020 commencement. The COVID-19 pandemic prevents us from sharing this special event with you in person. We trust, however, that this virtual celebration will clearly and unequivocally convey to you how important each one of these spring 2020 graduates is to us, how much we respect their achievements, and how much admiration we have for their family and friends for the support provided over the course of a lifetime. East Georgia State College is a special place and all of you are a special community devoted to assuring that every student in our region has the opportunity to achieve their dreams. Thank you for joining us today in this virtual commencement ceremony to celebrate the amazing students who have had the tenacity and dedication to take full advantage of the opportunities presented to them. Graduates, as this ceremony begins, please remember that few days as special as this take place in one's lifetime. As we begin this momentous ceremony, breathe and enjoy this moment that you have earned. Quickly recall a special learning moment at East Georgia State College. Smile and commit that moment to memory. Silently commit to say thank you today to all those who helped you achieve your dreams. Tonight, dream in vivid colors about the exciting future that awaits you. Family and supporters of the graduates, earning a college degree is difficult. Currently, only about one-third of the adults in the United States achieve a college degree. As you participate in this ceremony, you deserve to take great pride in your graduate as they enter the Academy of Scholars. In a few minutes, it will be my honor to award East Georgia State College diplomas to these amazing students. As your diploma is conferred upon you, graduates, I ask that you consider the words in a book of advice to graduates produced by EGSC entitled, A Word Before You Go. The message from the members of Phi Theta Kappa Honor Society to their fellow students in that book is, as you prepare to walk across the stage, celebrate yourself and what makes you beautiful, including the amazing achievement of earning a degree from East Georgia State College. Graduates, as you move forward with your lives, please consider the words of John Wesley. Do all the good you can, by all the means you can, in all the ways you can, in all the places you can, at all the times you can, to all the people you can, as long as ever you can. Congratulations, East Georgia State College graduates. God bless America, land that I love, stand beside her and guide her through the night with the light from above, from the mountains to the prairies, from the why we fall God bless America my home sweet home God bless America land that I love stand beside her To the prairies, from the oceans, why we fall. God bless America, my home, sweet home. From 
the mountains, to the prairies, to the oceans why we're from. God bless America, my home sweet. How happy is the little stone that rambles in the road alone and doesn't care about careers and exigencies never fears, whose coat of elemental brown a passing universe put on and independent as the sun associates or grows alone, fulfilling absolute decree and casual simplicity. Emily Dickinson. To be yourself in a world that's constantly trying to make you something else is the greatest accomplishment. Ralph Waldo Emerson. And finally, I beseech you, brethren, as a prisoner of the Lord, to walk worthy of the calling you've received, with all lowliness and gentleness, with long suffering, bearing with one another in love. Ephesians 4, 1 and 2. Greetings. I am Bob Bomer, and it is my honor to serve all of you as the president of East Georgia State College. First, congratulations to the families and the supporters of these graduates and to the exceptional faculty, staff, and administration of East Georgia State College. These graduates have the opportunity to celebrate today because of the high expectations you set for them, the countless hours you spent with them, and the love and support you gave so generously. You are the best. Graduates, this graduation ceremony is also called a commencement because it is a beginning, the beginning of a lifetime of opportunities available to you because you had the tenacity and did the hard work necessary to earn a college degree. My dream for you is that this diploma will lead to a lifetime of success. But it is not my dream for you which is important. It is the unique and special dream of success which each of you holds in your heart and mind that is really important. Graduates, define success on your own terms. You will never attain the happiness and satisfaction which success brings if you are chasing someone else's dream. So, Class of 2020, as you prepare this summer to start that new job, move on to another college for an advanced degree, or take whatever step you have chosen as the next one in your life, please think long and hard about what is truly important to you, how you choose to define your own success. Go get that done. Have confidence that everyone participating in this ceremony today will be standing in the wings, watching and waiting to help as you soar. Congratulations. What's up, graduates? Uh, first off, I want to say congratulations to you all for uh, graduating and, and getting past this, uh, this interesting time that we're in. You know, you guys are a different group of graduates. You guys have been through something that not a lot of people have been through in the past four to five, six, seven, eight years. And I think that's something to be said. You know, you guys have a different level of pres perseverance and just sheer will to get this done. And I, I really want you all to understand that and just kind of realize how special you are. We've all had a lot of things going on, whether, you know, people, your family has been sick or other family members have gotten laid off. And I think for you all to finish your associate's degree is a special thing and something that deserves to be, you know, uh, just rewarded and something that deserves to be talked about. Uh, I, I ask that you all keep that level of perseverance and drive. That's something that doesn't come along with uh, in everyday life. I think that this situation has built you all to continue your education if that's what you choose to do or continue and have success in every facet of life. I think that because we all have been through this and you specifically that you're in a point where there's nothing that, and I, honestly, that's just how I feel. There's nothing you can't do. 
Uh, there have been people who I'm sure throughout your life have told you that you can't or a class that you just felt like that you were not going to pass. And here you are at the end of May. In my mind, I know we're not there physically, but you're about to walk across that stage and get that degree. And that is a special thing. And I, I, I again, I want to say congratulations. And I'm very proud to call you all Bobcats. You guys are in the next chapter of your lives, whether you realize it or not, you are alum of a college that I hold very near and dear to my heart, uh, a place that has given me a lot of opportunity and that I've tried to give it back to every time I've had the chance and that a place where it's not a lot of people out there who are better than the faculty, staff, president, coaches, and AD at East Georgia State College. I firmly believe that in my heart. So if you get the opportunity, please tell those who have helped you along the way, thank you. You know, the most special thing you can do for someone is to just sit down and write a letter whether it's your mom, your your dad, your spouse, you know, a professor, a dean, whoever it is, and just tell them thank you. You never know if you're going to need them in the future to write a letter of recommendation or just to call about uh, something that you may be going through. And those are relationships that, in my opinion, uh, will stand the test of time and really be something that's beneficial on both ends. You know, uh, again, congratulations. I'm very, very proud of you all. And for you all to be called Bobcats and Bobcats alumni in my, in my, in my mind is a special thing. So just congratulations, soak up the moment, you know, uh, uh, celebrate, you know, within social distance, social distancing guidelines and just keep being successful. Keep being great. Your story does not end here. Your success does not end here. Keep on pushing. All right. No matter how, how, how hard times get, I'm sorry. Just keep on pushing, keep taking the next step forward, one step at a time, and keep getting these degrees. We need some educated people out in this world to do some great things, especially coming out of this pandemic. And I think we'll have some coming out of East Georgia State College University. Thank you all for allowing me to just speak to you all, and I appreciate you all listening. Have a good day. Good evening, faculty, staff, and my fellow graduating classmates of 2020. It is with great pleasure that I stand before you today to give words of gratitude and encouragement on this major achievement in this life's journey. Since being here at the East Georgia State College, I have not only learned beneficial and great academic skills that I will take with me, but along the way, I've gained friends that I now call family, been inspired by staff members in ways that I cannot explain, and also on our successes and victories that will never be forgotten. Although this journey here is coming to an end, don't be afraid to keep growing, keep climbing, and to keep soaring. For the Bible declares in Deuteronomy 31 and 6, Be strong and of good courage. Do not be afraid of them. For the Lord your God, he is the one who goes with you. He will not leave you nor forsake you. You see, I really didn't think I was good enough to even go to college. But I'm grateful that I took a leap of faith to be here. And I'm grateful for the people that pushed me and others into our destiny. So besides thanking my family, I would like to thank Mrs. Stacy Grant. She challenged me to go above and beyond every day and made sure her students never had a bad day and to always keep us smiling. To Ms. Sarah Young, thank you for giving us sound advice and having the open door and a place for us just to talk. And to Ms. Veronica Cheers, thank you for pushing me and giving me the zeal to be an overachiever. Lastly, I want to say, our learning experience here at the East Georgia State College, like life at times, may have felt like a roller coaster. They may have been ups and downs, highs and lows, twists and turns, and even some plunges. But we had our seatbelts on, we held on, and most importantly, we enjoyed the ride. There may have been some that felt like, why am I even here on this journey? Am I qualified for the ride? Well, we've made it to the end. It's now time for us to exit left, leap like bobcats, and climb to another level. Thank you. Congratulations, 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 East Georgia State College graduates, spring 2020. My name is George Frederick, and I was scheduled to serve as your uh, commencement speaker. As a result of COVID-19, uh, many events across the nation, the world, and our communities have been canceled. But we want to take this moment just to invite you to the December 2020 uh, graduation, fall graduation, so that you can be celebrated for this significant achievement in your life. We want to invite you and your family members. In the meantime, I want you to stay connected, stay safe, and remember, we're going to be all right. We're going to be all right. May God bless. Good evening. I am Dr. Sandra Sharman, 
Vice President of Academic and Student Affairs, and I will now present the degree candidates. President Bomer, these candidates have completed all the coursework required for their degrees in Associate of Arts, Associate of Science, Bachelor of Arts in Fire and Emergency Services Administration, Bachelor of Science in Biology, and Bachelor of Science in Nursing, and have been approved by the faculty. It is my distinct pleasure to present them to you for the conferring of their degree. Anita T. Akara, Caitlin N. Anderson, magna cum laude, Jayla K. Armstrong, Cortland A. Avery, Dylan E. Baker, Bruce D. Bass, Griffin J. Bell, magna cum laude, Madison L. Bearden, cum laude, Amber N. Beasley, Latia Patrice Berry, Daryl D. Bivens, Sydney P. Black, Brandon K. Bloom, John W. Bragg, Deneen Z. Brown, Daryl S. Brown, Janicia J. Brown, Kadrian L. Brown, Hallie E. Burbage, Gregory Burnett, Jessica R. Bird, Mariah Carraway, Mackenzie G. Carter, Selena Castro, Xiaojin Chen, cum laude, Olivia A. Christian, Keandra J. Clements, William A. Collum, Caitlin A. Cooper, summa cum laude, Ronnie K. Corbett, Matthew J. Cottrell, Jasmine C. Cox, cum laude, Catherine V. Cox, Jenna L. Cruz, Kimberly D. Cross, Lexi M. Cross, cum laude, Sierra P. Curtis, Derricka L. Davis, Jasper S. Doverly, Esther E. Huey, Robert C. Ellison, Destiny S. Ferguson, Alexis J. Thicklin, Rebecca N. Forney, Hannah E. Forehand, cum laude, Coy T. Fortner, Marcus E. Foster, Jared M. Fountain, cum laude, Noah A. Fritz, Tyra M. Grant, Michaela Z. Gilmore, Rashad H. Goodrum Tompkins, Zora M. Green, Amber M. Grimes, Patricia Godino, Justin K. Hackle, Taria L. Harrison, Kelly G. Herndon, Danielle M. Holland, Gerard B. Holmes, Quashanda D. Huff, Lindy Hyde, Kristen L. Ingram, cum laude, Jaquel Jackson, Tanzir Y. 
Jackson, Asia D. James, Anna M. James, Allison L. Jarrell, cum laude, Asia A. Jennings, cum laude, Tricia Jatwani, Sunny C. John, Shelby M. Johnson, Maniel Joseph, Charles A. Kelly, summa cum laude, Teronica L. Kelsey, cum laude, Sarah T. Kent, Jorian A. Key, Mary E. Key, magna cum laude, Tiffany D. Labont, Jada E. Lacey, Olivia Laird, Riley P. Langford, Elena I. Lee, Audra Lee, Logan A. Lee, Hallie E. Leggett, Scott R. Lesseur, Deja T. Lewis, Shaquille L. Lewis, Patrick R. Logan, John C. Lugering, Jonathan Lynch, Charisma J. McCuller, Michelle Y. McDowell, Ashley N. McGlon, Autumn N. McLeod, Catherine A. Meadows, Marissa K. Meeks, Louise D. Mejia, Austin M. Mercado, Gabriel A. Moore, Yolanda Moore, Trent L. Morris, Ann M. Quinn, Ashley N. Nobles, Hannah Oglesby, Jada T. O'Neill, Ashara J. Osborne, Ashton E. Pack, Kaylee Palmer, cum laude, Trenton L. Parker, Anant P. Patel, Christopher L. Patterson, Durante M. Payne, Madison K. Poole, Jacory M. Rainey, Marley F. Reiner, Chandler C. Ring, Lazaria T. Roundtree, Valerie L. Rowland, Shelby M. Ruth, John D. Scott, cum laude, Crystal Megan Scruggs, Casey A. Sims, Alexandra Smith, Cadazia M. Spikes, Reese M. Stalvey, cum laude, Aaron N. Stanfield, Tangela M. Stegall, cum laude. Niera A. Stevens. Connor M. Strickland. Rayanna P. Strickland. Aaron Sweat. Gregory T. Swistick. Alea J. Tankersley. Jacob B. Tate. Haley M. Taylor, Kevin J. Thomas, William S. Townsend, summa cum laude, Devon J. Usher, 
Raina C. Vautrin, Alexander E. Wade, Marion Z. Ware, Reba M. Warnock, summa cum laude, Sarah C. Warnock, Wilhelmina T. Watkins, magna cum laude, John White, magna cum laude, Ashanti Whitehead, Richmond L. Whitfield, cum laude, Audra I. Williams, Deacious Z. Williams, Michaela M. Wilmer, Destiny H. Wilson, Jamel D. Wilson, cum laude, Glenn E. Wood, cum laude. Quentin D. Houston, cum laude. George B. McKeon. Jeffrey A. Potter. Courtney L. Terwilliger. Benjamin M. Sikowski. Susanna L. Hall, cum laude. Tanner D. Peebles, cum laude. Jean H. Hooks. Megan G. Nash. Carrie A. Page. By the authority vested in me by the Chancellor and the Board of Regents of the University System of Georgia, I confer upon you the Associate of Arts, Associate of Science, Bachelor of Arts in Fire and Emergency Services Administration, Bachelor of Science in Biology, and Bachelor of Science in Nursing Degrees, with all the rights, privileges, and responsibilities appertaining thereunto. Congratulations, Spring 2020 graduating class of East Georgia State College. In the heart of eastern Georgia, neath the pines of green, proudly stands our armor mater, noble and serene. Lift the chorus to East Georgia, let her grace be told. Glory to our alma mater, hail to green and gold. May thy triumphs, dear East Georgia, ever be proclaimed. May thy loyal sons and daughters magnify thy name. Lift the chorus to East Georgia, let her grace be told. Glory to our alma mater, hail to green and gold. Through the years of time swift passing, we shall ever be. One with thee, our alma mater, one with the GSC. Lift the chorus to East Georgia, let her grace be told. Glory to our alma mater, hell 